to thank you sir and the entire faculty <laughs> of speed for being there for us for preparing such wonderful lectures the best classes from the app and effectively after that i started studying from neat following your lectures on the speed app okay i bring in all the wishes and greetings and behalf of all the faculty members and team of speed to dr abhik satarji for scoring a very good rank of rank number 129 in mch surgical group in neat ss 2024 session congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir great now can we get to know about uh, dr abhik I mean what all he has done from day 1 till date what has he has accomplished so i have done my mbbs from bj medical college pune and i have done my ms in general surgery from maulana azad medical college i passed out in 2016 sir and after that i did two years of sr ship from maulana azad medical college and one year of sr ship from aims and after that i was working as an uh, assistant professor in surgery with the manipal group and last year around april i started preparing sir i was working back then and i quit my job last year in august and i appeared for the ine exam where i scored an aml of 28 but unfortunately did not get a seat in surgical gastroenterology and effectively after that i started studying from neat following your lectures on the speed app from december and i qualified this time sir great a brief history but very good actually very interesting thank you sir <laughs> so you are in surgical oncology am i right surgical gastroenterology sir surgical gastroenterology yeah and the surgical gastro I mean you are going to continue this or going to give this upcoming may uh, nss also may nss actually sir there is no seat in jipmer and pgi seat is sponsored for aims actually i am not eligible because i am appearing uh, for the exams after so long after i have done my post graduation so okay. okay understood so now can you tell us uh, the idea of doing an mch yes and, yes sir uh, and especially of a uh, surgical gastro yes sir in uh, how it started when it started i mean even before ms or can you tell us something on that uh sir most of the cases which were done when i was a post graduate were from surgical gastro only sir and a lot of urology was also done but i developed my interest in uh, surgical gastro because my boss used to do whipples and uh, shunt procedures all those things and esophagus also so that was the point when i developed in interest in surgical gastroenterology and when i was working as an assistant professor then also i myself used to do a lot of surgical gastroenterology so that is the point from where i developed the interest in surgical gastroenterology and god willing i got a good rank this <laughs> time sir great now how you prepared what all you did to achieve this rank uh sir uh, i started preparing last year from april but that that time i was mainly reading for in and i read the general part of the semester it was a big help when i started preparing for this uh, neat ss exam in the uh, in this uh, this time and i started remember i followed all your lectures on billy and love basic concepts i have watched from the app sir and apart from that side by side i was revising and uh, reading the new things from statistan as well so Sorry. that helped me a lot to get a good rank this time so, so you went through the entire basic concepts and uh, bailey based classes bailey based classes yes sir it so was very good material sir and a lot of questions uh, had come in this exam from your lectures directly yes. verbatim yes yes there are some key areas which always we like and always stress on the class yes sir absolutely and, and uh, those areas and it's a, it's a typical template this is a template of an exam a standard yes, exercise this template yes sir so they ask based on that and uh, and but uh, it was the general surgery was almost taken for more than one and a half years actually because the exam was postponed yes sir yes sir adding uh, and that because of more time is there the more time. yes yes sir so hope oh, i mean a part of preparation of entrance is one side and part of learning is also happened simultaneously absolutely a lot of basics have been into it okay now how many questions did you attempt this exam i attempted 147 questions out of 150 sir what are the three questions could you remember that you left actually uh one was uh, two were image based questions sir one i was not sure what the image was and the other one there was a lot of confusion that mri of spine that they had given whether it's what this refism type 1 or type 2 and third question i left was from plastic surgery i guess sir. one question from plastic surgery i had left 
Okay. But there was a lot of paradigm shift in this exam because 70% of the paper was clinically oriented and the pattern which was there earlier of one-liners that is completely disappeared this time. So, yeah. And whenever there is a clinical parameter is there, then oh. question paper becomes easy because a low, lot of clues comes in. Yes, sir. The people yes, who sir. are little experienced have a low role to play. Yes, sir. A lot of things will come into place. Okay, fine. Yes, sir. Now, uh, what is your advice for the future aspirants? of MCH. My advice for the future aspirants would be, sir, to follow your notes and your daily-based classes from the app. Do a lot of MCQs. Give the GTs. And I think people should also make out some time to read Sabiston from first page to last page, sir. Now, new Sabiston is going to come now. New Sabiston, absolutely, sir. So, it's a news for all the general surgeons. Now, uh, time to thank and whom all you want to thank. You feel that they helped you from day one till date, what you are. Uh, I would like to thank you, sir, and the entire faculty <laughs> of Speed for being there for us, for preparing such wonderful lectures. I would like to thank my parents and my wife for standing with me through thick and thin. And all my teachers and my friends who have supported me during this difficult time because it was not easy for me in a position like this to quit my job and sit for preparation of the exam. But there were many people who supported me mentally also. I would like to thank them. And it was because of their hard, your hard work and their good wishes that I qualified this time, sir. There are two time in the life of a medical career, two time, uh, the kind of satisfaction of accomplishment happens, one, the first day of joining MBBS. Yes. Sir. That there is a, from a general population, you have shifted to a, a medical professional that day one it happens probably you can if, if it is yes you can say you can yes sir, yes, sir. With that, then you are right, sir. Uh, and then after that we get to know about this uh, medical career then it goes on that way and the second accomplishment that happens that is satisfied okay i'm i'm happy and satisfied is that what you today that means end of the day you want to become on that way and that you are into it yes it, actually it'll get automatically completed completion yes. is not issue Yes. Getting into is an issue. Getting into is an issue, absolutely. So right now you are uh, into it. So there is, there is an opening. And the closing is not the final day of MCH. The closing is the first day of MCH. First day of MCH. And, and these two days are the most beautiful days. These are the most beautiful days in the entire medical career. And absolutely. you also could... Uh, <laughs> I understand that now, sir. Huh? I understand that now once the rank has come. Yeah, in spite of so many things happening around, this kind of a relief. Okay, done. Okay, I'm in. Right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So it's a beautiful day. And I think you should completely enjoy this. This, yes, sir. this will be for 24 hours, actually. Yes, sir. And after that, which college, all that will crop in. Absolutely, How? sir. Okay, fine. I'm there. I'm enjoying. And whatever you want to happen now and today, it's a beautiful day for you. Yes, sir. Yeah. So once again, I wish you all the very best and all the success. And in a medical uh, SG, I mean, I'm sorry, surgical SG. I'm sorry about it. Uh, a studio kindly edit this. Okay. I'm sorry about it. I shouldn't do that. And I mean, once again, I do that. So this is a fresh edit. So I wish uh, great success. So on behalf of the entire speed team, I wish Dr. Abhik Chatterjee for a great and a successful career in uh, MCH surgical gastroenterology and as an MCA surgical gastroenterologist and he is going to serve thousands and lakhs and millions of people in his career and is going to be a, a great resource person for the specialty itself and also for the patients in his service. Best wishes to you once again. Thank you so much, sir. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.